1998, I started out by a phone call came in to me and said to me as a mother that there was a lady that was in New York City. I was living in the suburbs of New Jersey and a, a lady, a young lady had four children and she suffered from a very bad bone disease and she had twins and I was told, I remember um, the call said to me that she had no food. And of course my first instinct was to go into my cupboard and to help this woman. So I went into my cupboard and I drove, my husband and I drove 62 miles to bring a basket of food to a woman with four children that could not take care. And so I found myself after a while adopting the family. So every time I could, I made sure that they had food. And what started out with one family by just taking care of Thanksgiving and the Easter holidays and special days and as much as I could, I, it turned out to be five families. And so I found myself taking care of five families. And then the next thing I know, I started asking the Parent Teachers Association mothers there to help me to make sure that these families were taken care of. The next thing I know, I was traveling with 20 box of food taken to families that were in need. I had a very lucrative job. I was well set. I was planning on going to Florida after a few years and retired, so that was my plan. But then when I saw the need in the community, things kind of changed. I realized that something had to be done. So, of course, when you have compassion, you have love, you have a heart, you want to make a change, you want to do something different. So the first thing I did was that um, I spoke to someone and they said to me, well, there's an organization that will give you money if you're feeding families. So I said, okay, this is great. Got my first $8,000 and I said, whoa, I can feed the whole world. <laughs> and so I found out what started out, I saw a line of 50 families. And then about 2004, 2005, there were 360 people online every week looking for food. And it bothered me a little bit, but I started in the work and then I just got up one day and I said, you know what, I'm gonna leave my job. Took a survey, I'm gonna leave my job, I'm gonna help some families. And so my family and I packed up, yes, and moved to New York, moved back to New York. And so out of that came bed -Stuy Campaign Against Hunger, which is a non-for-profit organization. And presently we are feeding, last month we fed 22,000 individuals. What started out as we thought with one family became 20, 22,000 individuals, over 1.6 million